And now to our other top story where people are starting to gather at the state capitol to protest immigration decisions in this country and the state. Thanks for joining us at 6. I'm Ashley Katz. Right now, two known locations in Arkansas are being considered to house immigrants that were detained at the border. We'll have more on that in just a moment. But first, krk 4 Susan L. Corey is live at the Capitol. And Susan, you're following everything as it happens. How's the turnout been and what are people saying? Well, Ashley, a lot of people out here are concerned and afraid of what could be coming, calling this a basic human rights issue. They don't want any immigrant children or their families detained in our state. And they're arguing that those families are seeking asylum, so we should be trying to help them instead of locking them up. You can see a couple dozen people out here right now, but we've been watching the crowd slowly grow, especially over the last five, ten minutes. Now, organizers are expecting over a hundred people out here and several immigrant rights groups working together to put this round. On. Now, this all stems from President Donald Trump's executive order to detain immigrant children along with their parents. And organizers tell me they're also objecting to comments Governor Asa Hutchinson made about housing immigrant children in a compassionate way. Now, protesters say there's no such thing, arguing that locking up children and their families denies them of their basic rights. And they also tell me their goal tonight is for state and federal lawmakers to hear their urgency and act and hopefully make sure that no immigrant children or their families are detained here in Arkansas. Arkansas. Live at the Capitol, Susan L. Corey, back to you.